Welcome back. I'm Jay. We got Steve behind the camera. This is the Heads Up Show, and today it's all about Princeton. All about Princeton. So this is a big happy birthday to football, specifically college football. 150 years going strong. Many people were tuned into the undefeated Alabama LSU game. There was another undefeated game going on. Undefeated Princeton versus undefeated Dartmouth in Yankee Stadium for the 150th, kind of an anniversary game. And they brought out all the stops. Steve, you see, you see what I'm wearing here? Oh, I see it. You know, I had to, I swear, this is what I was wearing on Saturday to watch the game. It's looking proper, I can't miss you. No, it's all about the P. Princeton had some kind of kind of throwback inspired uniforms. They were pretty cool. And we actually do some work with Princeton. So what we've got here is kind of a combination between a helmet that we did for someone at Yankee Stadium that was a, a giveaway helmet for somebody during the game um, and, and Princeton. So we've got some Princeton 3D bumpers that we're gonna put on the helmet. And the helmet that was given away had these 150 uh, decals on both the front and back bumpers. This is gonna be a proper build and I wanna go over all the little pieces that we're kind of putting into this thing. This is kind of a special one. We're gonna be shipping this thing out to a very special person, good friend of the show and the program and everything. And we appreciate that every, all the work that he does for us. Um, and I can't wait to see uh, photos of this thing in his office somewhere. So let's get right to this guy. I am going to start, Steve, with a matte navy youth Riddell speed helmet. We've talked about it before. We love to use these youth helmets. They're easy to work with. The Because they don't have any um, bumpers on the fronts and backs that are attached to the padding, everything sticks nice and neat and, and flat to them. The color is the same. The face mask that goes on is gonna be an adult. We're gonna put an Under Armour uh, visor on here. When this is done, you're not gonna be able to tell the difference and it's gonna look great. This is for a, disp a display piece. So we don't need to have all the fancy expensive guts on the inside. Yeah, and speaking of the display pieces, like you said, we already made some. They went out to Yankee Stadium. That was pretty cool. And so why? Is Princeton playing in the 150th game, Steve? Do we know the answer to that question? I don't know, do you? Well, Princeton played the first game way back in 1869, the first college football game. It's Princeton versus Rutgers. Oh, wow. And for this year, obviously, it was Princeton and Dartmouth. And so I think Princeton was going on like, they were on like a 16 or 17 game. 17 win games. Streak. Yeah, they won 17 in a row until that game. Dartmouth was also undefeated, like you said. While you're laying that down, let me talk about these decals a little bit. These are different. These are matte. Let's give a little shout out to Healy Awards for knocking these things out. These are great, and they did them on such short notice for us, which is uh, really nice. We really do appreciate them working with us. I gotta think it's my favorite look, Steve, as yeah. far as decals go. I agree. When I never knew such a thing existed, man. Especially with this color scheme, the typical gloss vinyl just i don't know it would have been too much on the matte helmet this matte decal goes with the matte paint i have a feeling we're going to do more and more matte decals in the future and from a photography standpoint you don't get that glare on there right it makes life which easier is, which is nice dude those sleeves like those sleeves <laughs> it's amazing we're going to do the chin strap we're using a shut elite hard cup chin strap and if you're new to the show you haven't figured it out yet we make football helmets yeah so yeah if you are new to the show please give us a like subscribe if you want to see more videos like this or if you're kind of into helmets and equipment and all that in addition to talking about helmets in general we make helmets here this is actually you know i guess you could consider this a concept piece oh yeah you know it's a custom piece but we'll do concept pieces for nfl and colleges we're Always looking for your feedback below, so let us know what kind of themed helmets you'd like to see in the future. And of course we sell field use and collectible helmets, and we are loading up the front of our studio desk. So if you want to see your team represented, send them in to us. It can be high school, college, football, NFL, CFL, doesn't matter. We want to fill this desk up. And big shout out to Johnny Mack. 
Johnny. He hooked us up all the way from Canada. He sent in several decals. Fan of the show. Thank you, John. Really appreciate it. Yeah, big thanks, John. All the way from Canada. You didn't have to do that, but we do appreciate it. And you're now on the wall forever, I guess. You made it. All right, so we've got a silver face mask going on here. This one's going to be an S2EG SWSP. The silver's going to go nice with the decals. If you want to see your school or your team built on this show, here's our address. If you send in a decal set, and maybe even a helmet, but if you send in a decal set, we're happy to do your build on the show. Ask your coach, ask your equipment guy. We would love to do it. I really like these kind of large decals on the back. It's just not common. Our embossed tech flag. Princeton wears all embossed tech flags. Boom. So here she is, Steve. Riddell Speed Youth Helmet with an S2EG SW SP face mask. We've got an, a red Under Armour visor. Uh, we've got Under Armour clips. We've got a shut Elite hard cup chin strap. We've got the custom decals from Healy Awards. We've got the custom 3D bumpers. We've got the embossed tech flag. Got a lot going on. It's a simple, simple build for us, for sure, but I think it looks fantastic. If you like seeing us put helmets together, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Yeah, so leave your comments below. Let us know what teams you want to see us build, or actually, no, here's Steve. Where do you think football is going to be in 150 years? Why don't you leave your ideas for that below? That's uh, great. Like, subscribe, click that notification bell if you want to see more videos like this. Until next time, cheers.